Hello guys, uh, today I'm gonna give you guys a quick review on our new products, uh, which is uh, these two type of grease. Those are generally using for a sliding damper or MS suspension. And it is um, same as the Tamiya, uh, the extra hard uh, grease, which is most people they come and use for sliding damper and the MS suspension system. Um, there's two type we have right now and the one is a standard one which is this one and the other one it is extra sticky so as you can see this one it's really sticky it's like some kind of like a paste like this it gives you really a um, super resistant and the uh, damper reaction okay so just be careful with using this type of and the other one which is a standard one which is right here this is a standard one it's a slight, it's a sticky too, but it's not sticky as that one. Um, I would say this one, which is a pink cap, is the same as, almost same as the red one, which Tamiya has right here. Uh, the problem with Tamiya one, I think it is like, it is like, you know, uh, it's in between of this one and that one. I would say it was like this. So this is standard, this is slightly sticky, and this is super sticky. Uh, that's why I have two type. Uh, it depends how you're gonna apply on it. Okay, let's move to how you're gonna use it, okay? Um, in general, we're gonna use more this than this one. So if you're buying um, our grease, uh, make sure you're having bows because they're for different purpose and they have a different reaction that depends on your um, cutting. Uh, let's use uh, the MS suspension as a uh, our uh, demonstration first thing it depends how you cut your chassis and this is a ms pro chassis which is second generation on this ms suspension chassis i don't have any cutting right here so there's no any modification and there's no any modification on this part as well same on the front so we keep everything as original as you can see on ms on ms pro chassis um if you're cutting uh, the chassis, like uh, the way I cut, is supposed to be the back uh, move pretty freely, and the front it still moves, but it's slightly a little bit resistant. On my opinion, I always use the uh, standard grease from our website, which is m4d10.com. I'm gonna apply on all the pole first, okay? So make sure go all around this pole like this, okay? So I just finished, so all the pole has all the grease and make sure it's a standard one, okay? Then next we'll um, apply the spring on it, okay? Okay, it's like this. And uh, by the way, if you buy the MS suspension chassis from our website, which is m4d10.com, it is always come with the uh, four expanded spring and including we also will apply the grease for you. We will make sure it works before we ship to you. So next, we're gonna apply the standard sticky grease on the the slot right here, which is right here. Gonna apply like this, and then like this, okay? And we're gonna do the same thing on the back. So okay, next we're gonna do the real part of the, the bumper. Um, I will use a standard one first for the side, okay? Okay, next we're gonna starting with those uh, super sticky one, which is this one, the purple one. This purple one, make sure it's really sticky. Just make sure don't put too much, because um, if you're putting too much, it will get you a um, suspension system jammed, and it will stop moving. Okay, so we're gonna apply only right here, this part right here. Okay. Okay. So after we finish, we're gonna. Put this one on the chassis okay you will notice it's giving you like see really delayed reaction uh, like a damper style okay like this okay and the good thing about our sticky um, uh, the grease it is like it's water resistant and waterproof so make sure you wear glove when you apply to it because it's very hard to wash off okay so, uh, but uh, you know, for, for the demonstration, I'm not gonna wear my glove, but make sure if you try to do your suspension system, make sure you, when you apply these grease, make sure you um, wear gloves, because it's really hard. I try 
so many times to um after i get it on my hand i try to remove it really hard and okay let's do the next one next one is for the front remember front when i talk about it front it wasn't really that smooth so my opinion it is like a, just maybe apply a little bit of sticky one as needed okay i'm just gonna go ahead and using the pink one and the same thing you're gonna apply on the side first on this part right here okay and on this part too okay so and then we're gonna apply it right here do the standard sticky one okay so apply right here okay so after finish everything we're just gonna try put this one right here let's see the reaction see it's giving you really good at like a damper reaction like this okay okay next i'm gonna put all the wheel on and I'll show you the result of the reaction of this type of grease so okay um i have this car right here so i apply those grease like this have like a slow damper reaction like this okay and uh, this car because um i haven't put anything yet and especially the motor because you need to load something which means you have to put a motor and a battery and if you have a full setup it should be works better because you need some weight and uh, because when it's light it don't really uh works so you can see this one just with the battery and the motor it's already have like really good um like Okay, here's all for today's video, and um, you can find these two type of grease on my website, which is m4d10.com. I will leave the link on the bottom of the description. And if you have any question, um, uh, you better not ask me on my YouTube channel. Um, normally, I don't really read anymore. And you can follow my Instagram, which is uh, mad underscore 10. I'm going to also leave that information on the bottom of the description as well. So, okay. Uh, anyway, um, we're going to... Go ahead and come back to a more um, our new products review and for you better understanding and how our products works and how to especially how to set up and give you some idea okay see you next time